for us in this studio, and I'm sure for you, our next guest was, he doesn't think he was the front runner, but everybody else said he was the front runner for the entire season of American Idol. He was still favored to win going into the finale. There was some question about that, but something happened, one of the biggest many feel upsets in Idol history. <laughs> After the nationwide vote of nearly 100 million, the winner of American Idol 2009 is Chris Allen. We love Chris, but we love Adam Lambert. Well, <laughs> We took their kids out of school today to be here today, so oh, feel a lot yay. in the front row here. Good. Um, Education. <laughs> <laughs> you're educating them, Adam. Oh, you're educating them. <laughs> so you didn't seem to be upset at all when that was announced, when Chris was the winner. Were you happy for him, sincerely happy for I him? I was thrilled for Chris. I mean, we, you know, it would have been anybody at that point. It's him or I. We knew it was down to us. And, you know, I was so happy having sung with Queen and Kiss that I didn't really, I was like, great, cool, what a great night. I don't, it doesn't matter to me. All right. I get to make an album. Rumors are swirling on the internet that you're going to be the new, like, lead singer for Queen. Yeah, I think those are rumors. I mean, are they Adam? Yeah, Adam, look me in the eye. They are rumors, I promise. Um, <laughs> they, you know, we, Brian May and I talked, and, and there was mutual interest in maybe collaborating in the future. But. Yeah, I know. And here's the funny thing. You're so, like, blase. Oh, yeah, Brian May and I talked. No, not I at mean, all. I mean, I was literally, I'm telling you now because we can talk about it, but I, at the moment I was kind of like, Chris, pinch me, dude. Pinch me. Did this you, is like a dream come true. Did you know that they were going to perform like weeks before? No, we finale? knew that we were doing We Are the Champions a little bit before, but mm. we didn't know that they were coming until the night before. What, the night before? Yeah, and it was such a where They got up on stage and Chris and I were just like in awe. So, I mean, what did you do? Were you thinking this is like, they're, they're auditioning me? What's going through your mind? No, that, that didn't go through my mind at all. That was like, I get to sing with Queen is really what's going through my mind. <laughs> Was there anybody else? <laughs> was there anybody else throughout the season that just blew your mind as far as you know these celebrities that come in and work with you? Um, Slash was very cool. Why is that? Because he's he's the man. He's Slash. He's Slash. He's, Roses, he's, man. he's the rock guy. You know what I mean? <laughs> and we filmed our, our our story for the mentor shoot uh, on stage at the Roxy, which was like it just felt so authentic, like the real deal. You know what I mean? And singing "Whole Lot of Love" with Slash. Oh and my gosh! Just, was so cool. So what's what's what do you want to do? What's your what's your dream? What's your future here? I, I want to make an, a record. You know, I want to do. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. I may be going out on a limb here, but I have a feeling that's going to happen. Yeah, I think it looks really good. Um, Are people coming like just jumping on top? There's of you? some great people coming up that that want to work with me. Like and I can't say. Adam, yes, you can. I can't. No, watching? no, it's not, cool. no one's watching. No, it's just we're in the living room, right? <laughs> that's right. <laughs> Call me after the show. Yeah, we'll talk. All right. um, Adam, congratulations. Thank you. Seriously, you are fantastic. Such Thank a talent. You so much.